Hey everyone, and welcome to another Super Scripture Sunday. This is the week that we sit down and share with you guys a part of Scripture, even God's holy state of the week. Without any further ado, let's go and get it with it. So today we will be reading uh, St. Matthew chapter 5, verse 43 48. We are finishing up, we are finishing chapter 5, Love for Enemies. And it says, You have heard that it was said, Love your neighbor and hate your enemy. But I tell you, love your enemies and pray for those who persecute you, that you may be children of your Father in heaven. He causes his Son to rise on the evil and the good, he, and, he, and sends rain on the righteousness and the unrighteousness. Um, or, or, sorry, the righteous and the unrighteous. If you love those who love you, what reward will you get? Or not even the tax collectors doing that? And if you greet only your t own people, what are you doing more than others? Do, you, do not even pagans do that? Be perfect, therefore, as your heavenly Father is perfect. Be perfect as though your heavenly Father, as your heavenly Father is perfect, because... Yes, Jesus is the only person who was stepped onto this earth and never committed a single sin, not one. Um, so now I'm going to pray so we will join us for prayer. Dear God, I ask for those listening to this screen that you may have blessed every day and to pray that makes you secure. The rest of us is just beginning this life is getting harder and harder to live in each and every day. And it could be a sign that you come back soon, but we're also saying, God, that with you by your side, it'll be a little bit easier to live in. And there are so many people out there who just don't know. But the end is near and just don't know who you are. So pray that they step to your lives. Let them know who you are. Let them know. Hopefully help preach lost souls. Help us help us Christians lead preach lost souls and save those who from eternal damnation down below. And hopefully get them up above and eternity up above forever. In Jesus' name, amen. So that's it for Super Scripture Sunday. By the way, if you're wondering what I, where I am, I'm in a hotel bathroom right now in Virginia for vacation. And I just got out of the shower with my hair. Look at this. Anyways, so we'll see you guys next Sunday.